There's been a lot of bad talk about guns in the news lately, and I think it should stop. If corporations that ma manufacture guns are people, aren't guns people too? <laughs> do they not have feelings of their own? If you cock them, do not people bleed? <laughs> if you hold one, do they not feel like a prick? Everybody on the news is talking about how they feel. But nobody's asking the guns how they feel. If you tickle them, do they not miss fire? I'll tell you how they feel. Cheap, used, misunderstood. <laughs> if it was up to them, they'd be shooting themselves in the air every day in celebration. Oh sure, sometimes the bullets that go up come down into somebody's head. But that's not the gun's fault. That's gravity. What are you going to do? Shoot Newton? <laughs> and how are you going to do that without a gun? Guns are some of the most misunderstood weapons of mass destruction. I can't tell you how many times I've been in a bar and heard some guy said, say, my gun, she just doesn't understand me. <laughs> well, you know what? That works both ways, pal. It's like the NRA says, guns don't kill people, we do. Guns aren't the problem. It's people who don't have guns who are the problem. We have to put a gun in the hand of every man, woman, and child in America, especially the infants. Why, some of my best friends are guns. I know a girl who married a gun. She has ten kids. The gun keeps going off. <laughs> guns aren't the problem. It's people who are the problem. That's why we need guns. To get rid of the problem. I'm James Tripp, and I'll be back. Maybe not here, but I'll be back with another Trippatorial. <laughs>